What's up, everybody? How's it going today? I'm the Digital Ham, and today I've got you guys in the booth with me. That way I can explain to you some of the things that are going on in my world that I want to share with you guys. So first of all, let me just state, I am probably sweating that you guys can physically see on my forehead. And that's because I've been in here for about probably about two hours trying to record the intro to this video and the video itself because I'm a fucking idiot. Oh, guys, I'm trying here. So anyway, so welcome to the booth. Uh, the first time you guys have ever been inside here with me while I'm recording. And the first thing that I want to talk to you guys about is the booth itself. Real quick, the booth has actually been changed, guys. I've done a little bit more of the adding of the uh, sound dampening qualities to it. I've got some, some blankets back here. I got some up in the ceiling uh, to try to cut down on the reverb in this room. So that's the first thing. The second thing is, is I've never given you guys a true uh, idea of what this Sterling ST55 sounds like in a recording booth. So I wanted to bring it in here and I wanted you guys to come with me so you guys could hear firsthand. So now I'm sitting in a precarious way. I generally don't ever sit in the booth like this. I generally address the mic straight on and I get kind of close. Uh, now, right now, I'm pretty far away from the microphone, probably about, I don't know, six to seven inches away. And that's not the proper technique. And I'm at an angle, because you guys are with me, I have to do this, you know, for, for the viewing um, side of this video. Um, but this is not how I would address the microphone. I would address the microphone straight on, like I said, in a close, close proximity. And I would do whatever I'm doing that way. So... Let me give you guys just a eh, hint of what it sounds like. So, all right, let me straighten up the mic here. And you guys are going to notice that I'm going to have to kind of wiggle to get my ass as close to this microphone as possible. And that is what it is. So, anyways, it's very tight in here. <laughs> so, this is how I would sit right here, guys. This is the way that I address the microphone. This is what it sounds like when I'm actually where the acoustic treatment is supposed to help the sound. Right now, when I'm addressing it, it, it is exactly how it needs to sound. That sounds like somebody dropped a bomb on my house. So, why is this important, guys? So that's, that's just a little you know hint of what it sounds like. Um, this is not my normal interface. This is a different interface. I went ahead and purchased a different one because I had... A kind of a major issue with the one that I previously had. I've done kind of like a, a brief overview of the uh, interface that I had before, but now I'm using this guy. Hold on. This is the Behringer Euphoria UMC22. Um, some of you guys might ask me, why why'd you make a, a change? Why would you change out your interface? Uh, the main reason is preamps, 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 preamps. If you are using a phone, a microphone like this, that it requires a lot of juice to run, and I'm not talking about phantom power, I'm talking about the literal, the gain that this thing requires is just immense. And it's not like a lot of other, you know, condensers that I've used before. And so for that matter, I have to have good preamps on my interface so that I can supply this thing what it needs to operate properly uh, as a whole. So. Um, I, I'm using that, and I'm extremely, extremely happy with the uh, outcome of how quiet the preamp is and how quiet the overall recording is versus previous with the, the you know, the Xenix 302 USB. So I'm going to be quiet for just a second. Hopefully they're not screaming and yelling in the other room, um, and hopefully you guys will be able to hear how quiet this, this uh, setup is that I currently have right now. And of course, as soon as I say, oh, hopefully they don't make noise, they're going to. <laughs> That's my family. They're like a bunch of, uh, I don't know, wild elephants. Anyway, so that's that. Um, that's the the reason why I went ahead and got that different, um, you know, preamp or not preamp, but interface. And um, just an overall, you know, get let you guys hear what's going on and why I'm not producing as many films as I usually would. Um, and videos and that's that's pretty much it guys it's it's just the fact that I'm working on the stuff that I have and I'm trying to make it sound better and better and better so thank you guys for tuning into this video and as I'm 
outroing this video, I'm going to go ahead and address the microphone in my proper manner. So I'm going to squeeze up in here. Thank you guys once again for stopping by. I hope you guys will hit the like button if this was helpful to you. If you guys have a question, comment, or concern, please leave it in the comment section below. And as always, guys, please subscribe. If you do, make sure you hit that uh, bell for notifications. Once again, guys, thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Ciao.